morning guys this is Derek King Kingfish on YouTube just doing a quick video of some of my additions sorry about uh, the cloudiness in the water I just fed them a second ago but that living stone eye that fully colored up male right there just added him loving it got him for a great deal at LFS because he was having a couple two or three problems in there then that Mori eye right there beautiful fish added him um, absolutely think that fish is gorgeous I also added another living stone eye. That one right there. I added him before I added the other male. It just happened to be a good deal when I was browsing some LFSs. I think he's a male because he does have egg spots on him. See that upside down catfish? Gorgeous fish. I actually have a prettier black one that likes to hide out right here. Um, but absolutely gorgeous fish. It comes out from time to time. That VC-10 made it back to the tank. I figured I could put him back in there. Um, since I have some other ones that are a little bit more dominant than he is. But, uh, uh oh, we're about to see. Is there going to be a problem? It might be. Maybe I do have to take that living stone eye out. But we'll find out. We'll find out if he makes his way or what happens with him. But uh, we'll see. We'll see with him. He's oh and that yellow lab right there added him too. That living stone I'm trying to figure him out still. He has his mean colors on right now, so we'll see. I'm trying to see if he can acclimate well to this tank. I know he didn't play well where I got him from, so we'll find out. But other than that, guys, just wanted to show you guys some of the additions that I've, I've actually added. Enjoy yourselves, and uh, if you happen to be in the market for a living stone eye fairly large, at that fully colored up one doesn't work out wherever he is let me see where is he at if he don't work out then uh see he actually has the mean colors on right now if he don't work out then he might be in the market for a new home but we'll see all right three in the water guys but i just actually fed them but let me kind of go through them uh the tiger ubiquitin or zebra ubiquitin right there um that Buca Chromus had just kind of swam back by. That Johnston Eye, or Johnston Eye is going to be a beautiful fish. Um, that albino, ze albino Zebra. That Polystigma that kind of looks like a um, Living Stone Eye. This will be a gorgeous fish when it actually gets bigger. But my absolute favorite fish of them all is that fish there. It's called a Madoka White Lips. I've been looking for one of those fish for a while. It's a juvenile. When that fish gets big, oh my God, is it gorgeous. It's a deep, deep blue with uh, white lips. Both males and the females kind of look the same when they get older. But other than that, those are my new additions. I'm loving this 50 gallon right here too, just with the fish I put in there. I actually have another upside down catfish that kind of hides in that picture right there. But uh, other than that, and then that OB actually came from the other tank. I'm going to catch him and put him back in there. But he was causing some problems over there, so I took him out. But he seemed to be doing all right in here. But, uh, yeah, I just fed a couple minutes ago. That's the debris from the food. Um, but other than that, everybody enjoy, them, enjoy themselves. Like I said, that Johnson Eye, the Madoka White Lips, Polystigma, uh, Turquoise Hat. Where is it? Turquoise Hat in the back. And, uh. That, that albino zebra right there for this tank. So, all right, everybody enjoy. Guys down here, I'm actually interested in parting ways with when I can. So, if you happen to be in Southern California or you're interested in paying for the shipping for these fish, and I'll give them to you dirt cheap. They're actually okay in size. That um, that OB right there is about. Four and a half, five inches, the same with that that other zebra right here. So, uh, but other than that, and that jewel cichlid, it's probably about three and a half inches or so. Yeah, these fish are okay in size. They just, they don't like to play well with my other fish, and I like my other fish a little bit better. So, I've, each of them have picked a person to fight with in that other tank.